Just a quick video tonight. Exciting wine. Had this one in the past. So this is uh, Valderiz's uh, Roberto del Duero. So they call it the Tinto grape, but it's it's Tempranillo. So they call Tempranillo different things around Spain, uh, but just the same grape. So really the best place for Tempranillo in the world is Spain and Roberto del Duero being one of the regions. The other one being uh, Toro and Rioja being probably the most famous, but this wine I bought, it, it had a shelf talker, one of those, you know, 94 points, blah, blah, blah. But I did read about it in Wine Spectator, and I did, in my mind, mentally say, you know, if I see this, I'm going to buy it. And it's sub $25. I had some of it last night, have a little bit more today. And, you know, really great color, dark wine, you know, big tasting wine. And I thought for sub $25, it was... It was pretty awesome. I mean, one of the best sub $25 ones I've ever had. Uh, especially this year, if not maybe ever. I mean, just that that good on that level. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Great. Gosh. Gosh, gosh, gosh. I mean, you'll spend $25 from Spain, and you get you get just really, really good wine. I could taste a little bit of the oak. I'm pretty sure it's American oak. But but just delicious. Delicious wine. Layers of flavor. Good tannin. Good body. Good length. Good everything for, for the price. Gosh. I know they have a higher end version. It's in the 50s and 60s. I had that one time and that was unbelievable. Never seen it since. Not even sure if they still import it. This I see randomly in random places. And I'll tell you what. If I see... I'm going to get more of this 2017... I'll make this sort of my house wine until the 2017 vintage is gone. Uh, this wine is is just awesome. You know, you struggle to find these Cabernets in that $20 range, and then you have something like this that's just so amazing. For 25, sub 25, I think it was 24. There's just no need. There's just no need to even bother. Uh, this is big. This is brooding. This goes with all the same things that a $20, $30 Napa Cab would go with, and just awesome. I'm about to have it with some pork tenderloin. So, I want to just do a quick video when you find a great wine, you don't want to forget about it. So, here it is. Have a good night.